Anita, five o one na. Hi, adi late kung late. <laughs> Teka lang, check ko lang kung ano. Naka ano na sa flip. Tara, anta sa upuan ko. Record sa personal account. Share mo sa lahat. Sa buong ay may viewers na tayo. Wow, may fan. Wow. <laughs> wow, bakit 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 may nanonood? <laughs> bakit may nanonood? Tama na ako, ano ba 'yun? So na live pa yung ano, pag pag ano natin, pag didiskusyon natin na late ako. Ayun, marami na nga ang ano, marami nang nagbabati. Anong binibati nila? Eh di, happy birthday daw. At iya, hot seat kita. Good afternoon everyone daw. Well, Jason, in the hot seat. <laughs> Ayan, daan na daw guys ang inyong ano, ang inyong mga katanungan. Payag na payag. Game na game siya. Sasagutin niya daw lahat yan, kahit ano pa yan. So ayun, mag-i-intro no, muna ako. Dahil, ano, dahil special ang aking guest at special ang JSU natin ngayon. Ayan, mag-i-intro muna ako. Welcome sa lahat ng nanonood ng ating Just Success interview. So, ayun nga, special ang ating guest ngayon. Si Phoenix, medyo masakitan siya. Hahabol daw. Pero yon dapat dalawa kaming ano, gigisa kay bossing today. So, solo flight muna ako. Ako muna ang inyong host para sa hapon na ito. O, alam niyo naman, hindi ako masyado lumalabas ng Just Success. Pero dahil kay bossing, request niya, dapat daw nandito ako. May clown daw dapat. Ako yung clown. Hindi hmm. <laughs> lang pwedeng sumayaw, bossing. Hinihingal na ako. Huwag ka na magpasayaw. Ganon. <laughs> Inahanap tuloy ni Marcy Phoenix. Mamaya, uh, Mahar, baka maka-join siya. Pero hindi, hindi sure. So, yon Sa lahat ng mga nanonood, kung balak nyong i-share to, i-share nyo lang. <laughs> Share nyo lang kahit walang kwenta. Joke. <laughs> hindi. Um, comment lang kayo kung saan kayo ngayon nanonood. And magtatanong tayo kay Bossing ng mga ano, ng mga tanong na hindi nyo pa alam, <laughs> hindi nyo pa alam ang sagot. So, dahil ako ang host for today, bawal si Bossing mag-English. <laughs> puro tag- puro, ay hindi, puro Tagalog ang sagot niya sa akin mga katanungan. Okay? <laughs> bawal kang mag-English-English dyan. Kailangan Balang tatagalogin. <laughs> Ayun. O sige, mag-greet muna tayo ng mga manonood. Ayan. Baliktad yung pangalan Melanie siguro to. Si Melanie, ha, advance happy birthday daw, sir. Um, si Sherry, sabi niya, get to know that, ah, ano to? Get to know the top five, ano, books, Jason yes, recommends. comments. Ah, okay. Ito palagi ba, hindi po kasi. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ayan, sa lahat ng manunood at mag-share nitong interview na to, meron naman pala kayo mapapala. May giveaway si Bossing. Get to know the top five books, Jason recommends. We'll give you the list as as a gift. So just share this interview on your FB wall and comment down share to receive this free gift. Ayan. So yon happy birthday daw sabi ni F San Luis. Tapos well, bakit ako lang hina? Oh, oh happy birthday. Na. Bakit? Gusto ko lang mag sa kanila. Ikaw naman. Ito, si Ian Chavez who by good day daw. Si Christine uh, Kaga Saul from Bohol, si Jean, happy birthday daw, Sir Jason. Yung mga gifts nyo, ipadala nyo na lang dito sa Maynila, sa akin, kasi si Bossing hindi pwede tumanggap ng gifts <laughs> dahil naka-total lockdown. Naka-lockdown talaga siya sa condo niya, doon lang siya. So yung mga gifts sa akin na lang, pagka kailangan ng PayPal account, ibibigay ko na lang din. <laughs> Sa akin nyo lang, isend yan lahat. <laughs> Ayan, si Maria Teresa Olvido, waiting na kami, naghihintay sa birthday boy. Waiting na ka, God. Ayan, nandito na kami. Si Este- Stefania Baknag- Baknagan. Happy birthday, Sir Jason. Puro happy birthday ang bate. Mm-hmm. Tapos okay, si... Pa. Oo nga, hihing, hihingalin ako. Si Honey ba tumatawag? Be, mamaya ka na tumawag. Nagla-live kami ni Bossy. <laughs> um, eto, oh, so yan, ang dami na nga nanunood. Uh, huwag ko nang basahin talaga. Ang dami nyo. Baka ano, magtampo sila sa'yo. Si Vic sa Kaloocan, si Melanie na sa UAE, si JMU sa Cubao, si Maria Torres Olivo na uh, shared na daw niya tong interview natin. Tsaka si Lenny Babao, Marikina City. Ayun, share nyo lang tong interview na to guys. So yun, Anong gagawin natin, bossing? <laughs> Wala Ayaw. si Phoenix. Ewan ko din. 
Oo nga, ba- bakit nga ba? Bakit kung nga ba sinabing ikaw ang ano, ikaw ang i-guest ngayon? So, ano bang ano? Ano bang ba? Ang daming nanonood, bossing tingnan mo oh. Nung FCC, nung flip chat and chill ng Monday, ang konti ng viewers. Pero nung ikaw ang lumabas, ang dami. <laughs> so, merong ano, merong favoritism ditong nangyayari. <laughs> <laughs> At dahil birthday mo nga. So yeah, ang ano na lang um 'di ba nag-start ang VA bootcamp parang ano 4 years ago. So ano na yung mga mga bago mong natatag natatag na negosyo. Oh, na hindi naman natatag. <laughs> well, um alam na ba na lahat ng story ko, yung background story ko? Ay, ako ko, hindi pa din mo rin mong startan doon kung ano. Ikaw na, sige, ikaw na yung host. Hindi, <laughs> yeah, ako naman ano? yung pili ko. Sige. <laughs> Oo, sige, pwede. Mapapahinga na lang ako. <laughs> sige, yung background story mo muna bago ka ano, bago natin, bago na itatagang VA Bootcamp. Well, sige. i-fast forward ko na lang. Mga mga two minutes lang yung story ko. Kita mo. Uh, <laughs> sige. Pero, ano, sabi mo, ask, parang ask me anything. so Oo. Para mamaya marami pa kaming oras para magtanong ng kahit ano sa iyo. Oo. So, yeah, open. Sabi ni sabi ni Ana, gusto niya magano mag maging personalan daw. <laughs> Oo. Personalan so, talaga 'to. <laughs> Go bossing. Sige. So, um, well, for those of you that don't know, ako po yung founder ng Bay Bootcamp. Um, tong page na 'to and then yung yung mga courses, so yung mga free course, yung mga courses na 'yon. Um, it's something I created four years ago, so we're going in our fifth year now. Um, and ayun, tapos na, na, tapos na ako sa intro. <laughs> Ang bilis, nakakainis. Ba sinabi mo pa yan? Ang bilis na. <laughs> well, um, because I'm, I'm, well, before I founded yung gay bootcamp, um, I was a freelancer din. And I, I still am a freelancer. May, may mga clients pa naman ako. Um, pero when I started, parang nasa call center pa ako. I, I, I had a full-time job. Um, and then I did it parang on, on the side lang. Mga extra income, mm. mga 20k, 30k a month. Um, and eventually, nag-quit ako kasi I was earning a lot of money na. Uh, hindi naman a lot, I guess. A so, lot? Na, <laughs> 30, 30, 40k. Mas malaki kaya sa doon sa ano, kinikita mo sa BPO. Kumbaga, okay naman. Uh, pero ano eh, pero mas chill. Mas chill ang buhay. Oo, so, mas chill. So, ayun, um, and I was able to earn that. Nag-VDA ako. I was doing virtual assistant work. That's why na what we teach um, is to start as a virtual assistant. So what we're teaching you guys, start as a virtual assistant. It's easy. Para sa akin, it's the easiest place to start. Um, and then um, I was able to earn up to mga 50K a month. Diba? So usually, 50K, okay na yun, diba? 50,000 a month. Oh. Ayun guys, masaya na pa kayo sa 50,000 a month. Okay na ba Para sa single, pwede na yun, diba? Oo. Oh. Para sa single, pwede na yun. Uh, ano, extra money na yun. Tapos dito pa sa Cebu. Um, so it wasn't that expensive. Um, may story pa yun na I, I flew across different places and so on. Pero uh, I don't want to talk about that right now. Um, itong kasi yung topic natin. What, and why an entrepreneurial mindset is important if you want to succeed as a freelancer. So may topic naman tayo, di ba? Ayun naman, naman pala. Akala ko ka naman kasi maladaldalan lang tayo. May topic pala. Sige, <laughs> discuss mo yung topic na yun. <laughs> so, um, yun nga, I was earning mga 50k a month as a freelancer. Uh, pero I know that a lot of people, yung goal nila is to go to hit 100k, di ba? Uh, and at that time, hindi ko pa ma-hit yun. It, parang it was... It was impossible. It, it felt impossible for me to hit um, 100,000 pesos a month. But I did get there. Um, and I earned more pa than 100K. I earned like six digits. Ako, na, diba? il- ilan ang client mo ng bossing nung nag-VAVA ka? Nung nag-VAVA ko, mga project-based. Eh. So usually mga apat. Mm, okay. Oo. Pero nung nahit ko yung 100K, um... When I started earning more than a big day, um, what really changed was yung, yung, int- yung mindset. Right? Kaya mm-hmm. yung top, ano, int- entrepreneurial Uh-oh. mindset. So, ang oh, daming comment ni Romy din. Kaya nga, ba't ulit-ulit? Ulit. <laughs> Spam, <laughs> spammer. <laughs> Nakita mo rin pala. Uh, so, yon Tapos, dun mo naisip na ano, nung nag-earn ka na ng 100K, dun mo ba naisip na, teka lang, 
pwede kong ituro din ba to sa iba? Ganun ba? Oo, pero before that, parang yung, yung I want to parang focus yung entrepreneurial mindset kasi na okay. kasi when when you're still earning yun yung mga 50k, 30k, 50k um, and you want to hit the next level na freelancing mo, nasa mindset lang yun. Nasa mindset. Uh-huh. It's not your skills. Hindi siya sa skills. Because you can keep learning more and more skills. Diba? Um, pero what will really help you cross the threshold, cross, cross the barrier, is your mindset talaga. Um, and there are certain things, I guess there, there are a couple of things I want to point out. Um, na, na parang mindset shifts. M- mga mindset shifts. Wala, wala namang ang tatanong sa akin. Wala namang tatanong. Oo nga. <laughs> Puro share journal lang. Sige. Dumaldal ka lang, bossing. <laughs> About mindset. Sige. So, the mindset, yung entrepreneurial mindset. Ano ba yung entrepreneurial mindset na yun? And, and parang the, the mindset shifts that I made in order to reach the next level sa freelancing. Kung yun, ito yung 100K. Um, so, before before that, uh, before I parang went to the next level, when I was still um, earning, you know, mga 50K, ganun, I worked for clients, diba? I worked for clients. Okay. So, working for a client. And that's what we usually do. Apply tayo ng, ng mga trabaho. We, we apply for jobs, apply for projects. And we work for clients. Diba? We do the work for them. Um, pero, that's the first shift that I think that we have to make. That's a, that's one of the first shifts that I made um, when I, parang yung entrepreneurial mindset na yun. And now, um, yung shift na yun is instead of working for clients, um, it's working with clients naman. Okay? So uh-huh. working with clients. So parang you're a partner for their success. Ganun. Okay? You're not you're not working for them. Parang yung example ko dito is yung car, parang car mechanic. Yung mechanic ko. Okay. Diba? Ano yun? Ano nangyari sa car mechanic? <laughs> diba usually kung, kung ano, I guess mga mga gilid-gilid lang na sabihin mo na Mag- ano 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 sige paliwanag mo <laughs> so you, you tell them parang oy yung yung ano you you have them um sabihin mo lang na oy uh, yung palitan mo yung oil, yung oil ganun um yung brake fluid ganun fill yung yung tires fill with with air parang you just tell them what to do and then mm-hmm. the mechanic is working for you diba pero um may next level yung yung mechanic diba pwede naman mag level up yung mechanic na magiging partner siya sa sa whoever owns the car na na um, when there's a problem the car owner will say hey, parang may 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 some may, may there's a noise diba there's a noise when driving the mechanic he will advise the driver diba hey, the, the mechanic is going to work with the client instead of for the client na parang okay test natin ganun so para siyang advisor para siyang partner in the success to achieve the goal, which is in yes. properly working car. Diba? So um, when we're working with clients and, and you know, with freelancing, with professional services, um, with business, you know, when we're working with clients, we're helping them reach their goal through our solution. Mm-hmm. Diba? So yun ang parang number one mindset shift that I had to make. Um, yes. The second one, <laughs> The second mindset shift that I had to make is um, being paid for the value that I bring to clients, okay? mm-hmm. and not for work, not the hours of work. Because normally, when we start out of freelancing, we get paid based on the number of hours we work. Per hour, uh, oh, hourly, diva. Right? So uh, five dollars, ten dollars, ten dollars hourly. The more hours we work, the more we get paid. Right? Yun ang, yun ang usual yeah. uh, iba parang they're they're delaying the work diba para mas para mas marami yung oras Mm-mm. para mas marami yung oras so and and i'm also guilty of that sa, sa old desk pa dati um you know to earn more so na mo open mo lang yung si tracker kahit wala lang ganyan 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 ka lang move move lang ganun <laughs> um, but but what i realized that is that um, I shouldn't be paid for the hours I work. I should be paid for the value I bring to a company. I mean, this is a bit harder. It, yung first is a bit easier. This is a bit harder. And then you focus on the value you bring. Um, mm-hmm. I guess one example here is uh, yung 
let's say house cleaner. Let's say tagalinis ng bahay, di ba? You hire you hire a house cleaner, and <clears throat> what matters is the result, kasi di ba? Hindi naman yung oras. Oh, because if they spend eight hours cleaning the house, pero when you check, madumi pa rin, di ba? Useless naman yung eight hours na yun compared to house cleaner na gawin niya in two hours, pero yung perfect na job ganon. So it doesn't matter how long you do the work. What matters is the results, the output, the value you bring to the clients. So um, that's the, that's the second mindset shift. Yung parang yeah, you know, focusing on the value. And yung third, yung third, and this parang ties in the second one is parang being more efficient with your time. Because normally, um, even to office date, yeah, what we usually do to office date uh, is parang petics petics lang na. You know, so, so like time in ka, tapos nandiyan ka na. Oh, in ka, may in out ka, di ba? So in between, ah, parang chill chill ka lang ganun, petix petix lang. Um, and, and when we start freelancing, parang when we start working from home, a lot of us bring that same parang attitude sa, sa, sa work. Na, you know, uh, habang nag-work, parang browse browse ng Facebook, ganun. <laughs> and then going back to work, ganyan. Pero, that's not working efficiently, diba? And that's taking away time. That's taking away time that we could be doing something else. But like a lot, we've done a lot of surveys and one of the number one reason why people want to work from home is because they want to spend more time with their family, diba? spend more time with uh, the people that they love. Um, but when you're doing that, when you're parang saying, oh, trabaho muna ako kahit ng Facebook ka lang, you're taking away time from where it's most important. Mm-hmm. When I focus on value instead of time, I work to be more efficient. More efficient na yung, yung time ko is like when I'm doing work, I'm focused on work. And I complete the work um, in an efficient time so that I can focus on other things. Then I can I can do the things that matter to me um, and, and have that time there rather than yung petics or yung English pa, busy work. Um, so... Busy work. <laughs> De, wag na, joke lang. <laughs> Pinahirapan lang. <laughs> petics, petics. Ah, sige. Go. Oh, May, um, meron pa court. And yun, yun, those are the three mindset shifts lang. That's what really what I want to share, actually. Yun naman ang, ang story ko. Uh, three lang. Oh, three three lang. lang. Okay. Para sa labi lang. Para sa labi lang. I want to keep things simple. Para you guys who are watching, uh, yun, you'd be able to to take, kasi if we have 10, Wala kayong overwhelming no. kung, and you won't be able to really learn anything. So we'll keep it to those three things. Lang. Um, you know, working with clients instead of for clients, being paid for your value, and working to be efficient, working to be productive instead of ethics or busy work. And once I was able to achieve that, um, once I was able to make that shift, that's when, like I said, I was able to hit the, the 100K a month barrier in six digit na barrier, which also allowed me, since I'm more efficient with my time then, um, I could travel the world, yes. been work all around the world. Um, because I'm earning more money, I can buy the things that I want. If I see something sa Lazada, <laughs> or <laughs> online. Pa, ano, add, add to cart lang, at saka buy na. Um, and I'm also able to help others and be a blessing unto others, which is parang sa boot camp din. When I started, um, you know, it, it, it wasn't really... I didn't think it would earn, earn really. Of course, it's earning now. Some of my students, but at first, I didn't think it was gonna earn, earn really earn money. So, um, you know, I, I just put it out there, and but in doing so, you know, I'm being a blessing unto others because I was able to make these these shifts. So, ayan. Ayan. Parang nasagot mo na rin yung tanong ni Alex don, kasi tinanong niya kung na na naisip mo ba na magugrow siya as big as this as is now daw. Tapos, was your mindset already entrepreneurial as way, way back then? Or did it eventually evolve sa, sa VAB as, as VAB was growing? Sige, I guess itong second que- second half of the question I can oh, answer. Yeah. Okay. Um, actually, entrepreneurial talaga ako nung bata pa. Eh. Oh. Even as a kid. Oh, ano mong binibenta mo nun? <laughs> Kabata. Na, um, first binibenta that I can remember is ay, um, yung mga friendship bracelet. Nakikita mo yun. Oo. Magwa ka nun. Oo. Mga grade. Anak, anak, grade. Grade 
Trigger or something. Ganun. And then, mga pog, binenta ko rin. Binenta ko rin. Oo. Oh, oh. Mga basketball cards dati. Ay, oo. Oh, yung basketball cards, yun. Uso nga yun dati. No? Yung mga mga collect, collector's item na ano. Oo. So, Buy and sell ako dati ng, ng mga basketball cards. Um, assignment. <laughs> Pati assignment ginagawa mo tapos magpapabaid ka, ganyan. <laughs> o oh, yon alam mo na Alex, talaga entrepreneurial na si Bossing. Way, way back pa ng bab. Ma- maliit pa lang siya. Entrepreneurial na siya. Tapos gusto ko ding idagdag sana dun sa yung, yung mindset ni Bossing na yan na na-share niya at nag, ano din, nag, antal dito, na ano ko rin, na na tutunan ko din kasi talagang nung nag-join ako sa ano sa VA bootcamp yun, ta- yun talaga din yung ano nag-lead na, ni lead na ako ni Bossing doon so instead na nag-work para sa kanya i work for him. I, I, i work for him. instead of working for him i am <laughs> mali mali, mali. din english ko pa kasi sinabi na ang tagalogen eh so yun naging partner ako eventually ng VA bootcamp na parang ang ano na, na, na Nag-start ako as ano lang community manager tapos may offer na partnership ganyan. So parang ano, malaki malaki talaga yung kung sino yung unang-unang natulungan ni Bossing ako yon talaga. Ako yung unang ano, baka mapaiyak pa ako dito Bossing. Sabi ko na nga, wala akong na nag-share nang ganito. <laughs> Pero yon, ako yung unang-unang na, na ano, natulungan ng VA bootcamp na ano, na mag ano yung from VA naging partner ganyan pero until now naman din nagwo-work pa rin ako for for other clients pero yon um very thankful lang talaga ako na ano nakita ko yung VA bootcamp at si Bossing naging friend ko naging friend friends ba tayo Bossing <laughs> Ayoko ako nang dagdagan kasi ba mag emotional ako ba mapaiyak ako eh si Bossing dapat ang sentro dito ba <laughs> gawin ko ang limelight <laughs> So yun, nasagot na natin yung tanong ni Alex. Meron pa ako nakita dito mga ano eh, mga tanong bukod sa por- ang daming happy birthday greeting mo. Teka lang. Meron dito Kaya, eh. Sa Sunday pa yung birthday ko ah. Kaya nga, pero advance kasi buong month ng June birthday mo. <laughs> buong month ng June. Ayan, um, sabi nga ni Manuel, ayan, working from client to working with client daw. Si Del Rosario Rick's question, ano po yung best lesson learned in a way and a memorable one that you would like to share to newbies as freelancer? <clears throat> best lesson na memorable. Ang ah, hirap pa. Ah. Ang daming mga memorable. <laughs> ang daming mga pwedeng, pwedeng lesson. I guess when you're starting out, kasi as a newbie, it's hard. When you're, when you, you know, it, it's tough. It's a challenge. Uh, but what, what I keep saying, diba, it's 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 not easy, but it's worth it. Uh, so, for you to get like when once you once you start getting steady, parang steady income, it gets easier. But when you're first starting out, that's when it's hard. Because it's new to you. Aside from learning new skills, new routines, more, uh, may challenges pa of getting hired for the first time. So, all of these factors coming together. Um, and just like with any business, actually, it's like that. Then uh, you're you're working um, for yourself. Um, your parang your accountability sa sarili mo, and then you're trying to break into the market. You're trying to get clients. Um, it's very challenging. It's very challenging at first. Um, pero yun nga, if if you, it's not easy, but it's really worth it if you really put in the time and the effort and the consistency, uh, because you can. Um, I I really believe that. Like you, you really can succeed as a freelancer, uh, and it's really up to you. That it's really up to your grit, um, yes. your perseverance. Mo, if kaya mo ka win, uh, so you have to push yourself. So you know, it's not easy, but it's worth it. Oh, kailangan mo ng pusher na katulad ni Bossing kasi siya yung pusher ko dati. <laughs> Ayan. Sabi naman kanina ni ano, Josa, anong pangalan niya? Josana, May so, Penas. Uh, Juwa na ba yan? Ganyan ang pronunciation. Okay. Sabi niya, ang galing daw ng illustration mo. Yung ano, yung mechanico at saka yung ano, yung made. Yung sa mindset one and two mo. <laughs> yung mga samples. Oo nga. Nakarelate ka ba? Ayan, si Mahar sabi niya, what is your everyday routine to keep you motivated? Um, Ay, well, yung, yung motivation, uh, and I, I mentioned this every now and then, 
Um, I've actually been also in the IG story. Ko, diba? Motivation gets you started, but discipline keeps you going. Um, so, diba? especially right now, a lot of us are not mot- are, are not motivated. Even ako, diba? sa COVID, especially sa Cebu, ang daming mga problema. Sa mga, lockdown po. <laughs> no, sa, pol- sa mga politics dito, sa, ang daming mga issues. Um, and it's very demotivating. Kahit ako na demotivate ako. Pero, um, yeah, it's you can't stay motivated. Especially right now, you can't stay motivated. Pero what you can do is you can build discipline. Okay? So, um, I guess, you know, it's, it's, uh, I, I'm doing a daily exercise. I push up every day. Um, and, and I had to push myself to get started. Say, okay, um, this is something that I want to do. Because I may goal ako. The goal I want to achieve is 100 push-ups a day. Um, and in order for me to do that, I have to be consistent. Okay? So, yun ang motivation ko. Yung, yung motivation ko, I had that. Na, okay, ito yung goal ko. I want to reach it. And for me to reach it, this is how I get started. Parang may path na ako. So, I have my goal. And I can see ano yung path na going to that goal. Um, and once I started, you know, okay, I know my path. I know what I need to do every day. Um, I had the motivation to get started with my goal. I had the motivation to create my plan. Um, and yung, yung pair of putting in the daily effort, that's discipline. And that's building habits then. Okay? There's, a, there's a lot you can read about on building good habits. Pero you, know, you, you, need, you won't have that motivation. Most, most days, you won't have that motivation. So you have to build a discipline. You have to build the habits. And when you have that motivation, you, you can get started on yung mga good habits. Pero in continuity, yeah, you, you need that discipline to do it. Yon. So, yun, si Lenny naman, sabi niya, is it in your mindset as entrepreneurial, the course in the way that camp will need nowadays? And how did you mind helping all the inspiring VA in the Philippines? Um, I'm confused ako. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Intindihin mo na lang. <laughs> um, Bala ka dito. Um, well, as an entrepreneur, um, well, yeah, I, I wanted... Yeah, you know, well, when I started the boot camp, I didn't really think it would grow this big. I thought na parang side project lang. Right, right now it's really become my main thing. Because I'm dami natin students. We get a lot of, of students. We have a lot of people that we're helping. Um, so, you know, I, 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 it started out. You know, when we offered the course as a business, but it kept growing, right? Um, did you mind helping aspiring? And how? And how did you mind helping all aspiring um, to be MBA in the Philippines? Uh, because I wanted to. But to help din, diba? to help to help others. So yeah, that's that's that was what my mindset was. I'm not sure if I answered the question. But let me know. <laughs> okay. Si Manuel sabi niya, Manuel Martelliano. One thing I learned studying in boot camp is the goal is not to be busy but to be productive. Ah, okay. Just share lang si Manuel. Si Maria Teresa Olvido, how do you price your value po ba? And for for you, how do you how do we price our value? Um, it's hard. It's hard to discuss right now in in, in this short amount of time. Um, it, pero you have to think of what you bring to the business. Are you bringing in more business, or or like are you working on marketing? Are you bringing in more business? Um, a lot of times, what what some freelancers do is mag revenue share sila. Um, if they're doing something say directly sales and marketing, they do. Revenue share packages because directly directly related to value. Um, otherwise, it, it takes experience to be able to estimate properly, like how much value you bring. Uh, one way, I guess, is just you. Parang depends din sa sa sa, sa niche mo. Eh. Um, but like what I did before with websites is I priced I priced the website testing testing lang and see see if it and and you know i present na ito yung value na mabring ng website for your business and then see if it's something that they agree on diba and um, pro- probably you can find compromises in between ito si lisa sabi niya thank you daw sa lahat ng free free courses mo saka happy birthday watching from dumaguete kita no ulit si alex sabi niya next question given the success of bab and all your other endeavors what is or our next personal business endeavors. What are your plans for taking Flip and Vab to the next level? Mm. Um, um, Alex, <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm, I'm actually working on some. Hindi ko naman, 
nabasa mo ba yung message ko kanina ana sa ano sa chat natin? Oo, oh, yeah. nabasa ko. Hindi ko pa alam kung ano isasagot ko sa iyo. <laughs> sa Gora lang. Ganun naman pala tayo sa Gora lang. <laughs> yung gusto mong gawin ngayon. Oo, sige, share. Oh. Share share. Share na ba? Ano ba? Hindi ko na i-share lahat ng videos, pero I'm working ah, on some. Ano ano bang ano bang sabihin ko? I'm working on some like with the bootcamp. With the bootcamp, we've been able to make an impact in a lot of people's lives. Diba? We've been able to help um We, we've been able to help people earn more money. Diba? And, and right now, you know, free, it's in 2016, yung freelancing, parang, oh, yung, well, yung online courses of freelancing was very new. Diba? Yung pumasok mm-hmm. yung, uh, ngayon marami na, which is, which is nice. Which is nice because a lot of people are parang continuing the mission, diba? are, are on, on the path to helping others. Um, what I want to focus on right now is actually... Um, helping helping others pa rin. pero what i think we need in the world ba ano ang sentimental no ano what i think we need what i think we need in the world is more um of well-being and parang kindness uh, and love toward each other so um something around that actually is what what i'm planning to work yeah. on uh, parang happiness stuff. parang let's love one another ganyan <laughs> Something like that. Um, I have a plan laid out. I don't want to discuss all the details, but I'm I'm planning on working like on that because that's personally that's what I think. Um, what we need now, because uh, like right now, the politics, the grabbing this, the yung, yung divisions, the grabbing yung ano, yung mga away away and everything. Yan, o. Oh. Si Honey Be, pagkatapos na akong gambalain ka ng tawag niya, nag-hello siya sa atin. At sa Honey birthday ka, sa birthday ka na lang daw niya, ano, mo mismo siya babate. And world peace. <laughs> May pa world peace. Uh, eto, eto, since walang masyado ng tanong, ako magtatanong. So, hinanda ko to kanina. So, kung, kung newbie ka pa ngayon, kung newbie ka pa ngayon sa freelancing, mag- mag-e-enroll ka din ba sa VA course? <laughs> um, Oo, I think I would. I think I would if I was a newbie. Kasi it makes it easier. Kaya naman, kaya, alam ko naman kaya ko naman gawin without the course. Yeah. Pero, ang daming, there's so much information out there. There's so much parang input na nakaka-overwhelm, nakaka-confuse. Uh, what I like about, and I, well, I know that kasi even until now, I enroll in courses then if there's something I inter- I'm interested in. Okay, ang daming free information. And even with free information, you can get hired, you can learn the skills. Pero ang gulo. Ang gulo. Google ka lang ng Google. Oo. Parang, uh, parang structure. So, you know, the course gives structure. Parang may step-by-step, may structure. It makes it easier. It makes your life a lot easier. So, yes. <laughs> Sabi ni Maybelline, mukha ka daw kakandidato. <laughs> kakandidato ka ba? Uh, may bala ka pang kandidato. <laughs> yeah, sagutin mo, bossing. <laughs> Wala. Ang kandidato sa... <laughs> Wala daw. Niche. Wala siyang balak pumasok sa politics. <laughs> Eto, eto, meron pa isang tanong. Ang dami kong tanong dito. So, anong brand ng laptop ang bibilin mo kung newbie ka lang? Ano yung ma, ma, ano, ma, re-recommend mo? Ano yung pinakamagandang brand? Um, na, diba? Well, sa mga budget, sa mga budget talaga Asus ako. Gusto ko Asus. Um, high quality, um, budget friendly, kung mga lower end sa budget. Yung mga higher end ng budget, Um, Lenovo or Dell. Kaya pala yun yung mga ano mo. Mga pinamana mo kay Bell, Lenovo. <laughs> Oo. Pero dati kung Asus talaga ako yung pang years ago, nung start, yung mga first few laptops ko. So, oh. Kasi okay yung budget. Kahit yung medyo plastic yung quality, pero okay naman siya. Okay, ato, may may mga napukaw na mga ano tanong. Sir Jason, pag mag-e-enroll po ba sa bootcamp, pag natapos ang course, nagbibigay po kayo ng training? Um, we have a hustle challenge, uh, which, which, well, we have our coaches. See, Anna is one of our coaches that provides coaching and guidance to hustle challenge. Um, and it's parang, it's just, it's a program to help you get hired. So, parang may yes. feedback, ka, may coaching, may guidance. Ka um, so, on, yun, we have a lot of trainings then. Uh, if you look at the bootcamp page, we have a lot of trainings and we're working on adding more trainings as well. So, may mga internship kami. Pero yung ano, yung guided hustle challenge available lang yun sa ano, accelerated and complete course. Yung sa skill package yung pinaka basic, hindi siya available. So you need to upgrade 
parang avail yung guided health challenge. Sabi ni Honey, to answer din your question, be, ako din naman mag enroll Piggyback <laughs> ang sabi ni Chase, to avoid the risk of information overconsumption. Sige, be. Thank you. Thank you for your wonderful answer. Si Lenny, guided po sa VA course and alam mo na, ayon ah, sinasabi lang. If you take the VA course daw. Um, si Lino, before doing daw, sabi ni Honey, <laughs> Eto, sabi ni Maria Teresa, um, can you make a webinar na lang about how to price our value since you said it's hard to discuss it right now? It's in the Next Level Freelancing course. Yes, oo. Nasa complete course siya, actually. Complete package yeah. there. Ayan, sabi ni Honey, um, nag-hire din ang mga tenured freelancers in, na nag-take ng VAP course. Oo, yun din yung kagandahan sa student group namin kayo yung mga students ng karoon na ng clients, nagpo-post din sila dyan sa student group. Tapos nag-hire din sila ng mga fellow students sila pag may mga extra work yung client or naghahanap din yung clients ng mga ano, freelancers. So, yeah. Yeah. Si Christine, thank you po. Looking forward po na maka-enroll sa VAP. So, David ka. And si Alex, has your Christian belief somehow contributed nako, to how you have gone about with Flip and VAP? May hint kasi ng social entrepreneurship somehow ang mga ito. Sige, sumagot ka, bossing. <laughs> um, I, well, I don't think I, my beliefs have anything to do with, ano. May, may separation yun eh. Um, and and my, my, my own beliefs are pretty complicated, actually. So, um, my beliefs and my advocacy are, are separate. That's what I can say. I don't think, I don't think na because... And, and this is what one thing I want to parang to address is that no matter what your belief, no matter what your religion, your faith, you can have a social advocacy naman, eh, yung social entrepreneurship kanon, um, regardless of what you believe in. Because you know, I've, I've met lots of people, mga atheists, uh, mga Muslim ganun, and they, it's it's innate as human beings na um, at a certain time in your life you want to help. When when you're still younger. You want to earn money, but at a certain time in your life, you you do want to provide, yung parang give back to the world, you know? Yes. Ayan. Um. Gusto ni Bossy magchika chika na kami, pero last na to Bossy. Na pwede bang magseek down ng advice or guidance sa VAB kung di pa officially enrolled sa VAB? Pwede ka namang Mary Rose magpost sa flip sa ano sa group. So may mga ano naman doon na magsasagot. Usually ako din sa masagot din ako din si Bossy sa masagot. Ibang coaches, so yun. Pwede naman doon. Basta mag-post ka lang. At may, mag, may magre-reply. Magko-comment back sa'yo. Ayan. So yun, bossing. Gusto mo chika-chika na. So anong favorite color mo? Ayun <laughs> mo. Ayun mo. Kalong ko na na ilagay dito. Favorite color mo. Kung di lockdown ngayon, nasaan ka? Ganyan. <laughs> ano ba <laughs> Eh, chika-chika lang. <laughs> anong favorite color mo? Pink? Para ba tayo? <laughs> oh, pink. Yay! Pareho tayo! Yay, totoo! Hindi na loko mo lang ako, pink hindi naman. So, loko naman yung tapo mo. Bakit chika chika? Wala akong, actually wala akong favorite color. All colors are equally, equally, ano, nice. <laughs> <laughs> Kaya ba yung keyboard mo pa iba-iba yung color? Oo. Ang daming kulay ng keyboard ko. So, all color. Okay. Kaya makulay. Makulay ang inboy. Oh, so, kung hindi lockdown ngayon, nasaan ka dapat? Kung hindi lockdown uh, sa... Well, supposedly ngayon, nasa Manila ako to, to spend time oh, with people. Right. You know, Miss mo kami. <laughs> spend time with other people. You know, ah, spend time with ah, other people. Talaga. Sure, pero or, kasi ito talaga. <laughs> with other um, people. Pala, okay. Oo, oh, like... <laughs> I'm like... like Itong, sino ba tayo ko ng pangalan dito? Si Maria Olvido? <laughs> <laughs> ah, ganun. Oh, sige, edi wow. <laughs> so, anong handa mo sa birthday mo? Um, wala eh. Actually, bibili ako ng, ano, ng sashimi. Ng salmon sashimi. Um, wow. May, may kapitbahay ako dito sa condo. Um, parang, the only visitors we're allowed to have or the only way na may mga, may maka, ano, may maka visit is sa, sa condo. Sa parang kapit para lang. Oo, oh, oh, hindi yung pwede mga tagalabas. Oo, so kami lang dalawa sa sa friend ko mag ano, maglaro ng games, ganon. Mm, okay. Oh. 
Iha-hot seat na kita. Meron ditong tanong. Ikaw na bahala kung sasagutin mo to. <laughs> bahala ka dyan. Ako taga-host lang ako dito. Ha? Wala ako kinalaman Hindi dito. Ako Kailan po ang wedding? Hindi ko alam. Hindi ko alam. <laughs> Hanapin mo muna ako ng, ano, ng, ng, i, ng partner na <laughs> i-wedding. <laughs> Oo, ipapa-ano pa sa amin, ipapa-filter pa sa amin kung pasado yun. <laughs> okay, anyway, eto, sabi daw ni Honey kanina, napaka-celebrity naman daw ng sagot mo. Alin doon, Be, yung sa color? Yeah, oo. <laughs> sabi ko lang nga. Ano ba yung mga, I like a lot of colors. Violet, blue, um, <laughs> depende, depende rin sa, sa mood. <laughs> wow. Okay. Maubos ang oras natin pag sinabi ni, ko, ni bossing lahat ng colors. <laughs> Showbiz daw ang peg mo. Ayan, sabi ni Nebran, ay, what will be our driving force para magtagal sa freelancing? Um, what will be your driving force? Yung big why mo. I guess this, this comes with, and, and this also applies to business, Tina. Oh. Um, yung big why. why. Why are you doing this? What, what do you want to achieve? We all have things that we want to achieve, whether it's to, you know, because of our relationships with our family, and you have something related to that. Maybe you have something career-wise that you want to achieve, or business-wise that you want to achieve, um, or personal, maybe you have personal goals that you want to achieve, maybe you have an income goal or a savings goal or something like that. So you should always focus on your big whys, because that's what will keep you going. And again, throughout the journey of freelancing, throughout the journey of business, you will get demotivated. You will feel discouraged. There are times you will depressed. Ka. Um, but what will make you get up and still you know, turn on the computer, still get to work, is remembering that, okay, I'm doing this because I want to achieve this goal. So, yeah. Yes. Ito, si Alex sabi niya, thank you, though sa answers on beliefs and advocacy great clarification actually same stand tapos si Jane how many days po yung course so self paced siya Jane so depende depende siya pero kaya ng uh, two to three weeks lang matapos si Be pakihanapan daw ng partner sa lahat ng mga magpipresent ang ano <laughs> pakipasa ng resume niyo if you filter na <laughs> ayan Si Jeline, mahilig ka daw bossing sa board games. Do you play game of generals? Basta mga um, board, mga board game. Generals, <laughs> traditional board games. Um, oh, may mga, mo, search mo yung mga modern board games. Uh, ang daming mga modern board games. Oo, dahil sa mahilig siya mag-board game, ay eh, nang gagawin namin sa birthday niya. Mag-board game kami sa birthday niya. True soon. Ayan, si Be. Gusto ko yung tanong ni Be. Ano daw ang hinahanap mo sa isang babae? Babae pa ba hinahanap ni Bossing? Baka lalaki na joke. Yeah. <laughs> aso. Gusto ko yung aso. Ayaw ko lang bawal ko dito yung aso. Sagutin mo yung tanong ni Be. Huwag mong ano. Huwag mong Ayan. Bawal ka, ano yung hinahanap mo sa isang babae? Ano? Um, dalawang mata. <laughs> Ay, natawa ako. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Hindi yun, Bossing. Iba. Huwag yun ang mga sagot mo. Ayusin mo. Sige, sige. sige. Anong hinahanap ko sa isang babae? Wow! Parang ano naman. <laughs> ang lalim. <laughs> Kaya yung tanong na to. Um, yung ano, yung yung supportive. Uh, eh, <laughs> yung ba hinahanap ko? Supportive kami sa ni Bongski, ni Mahar. <laughs> ni Ben. May yung... Ay, yung yung support yung yung nagbibigay ng ng ano ng financial <laughs> sabi ko na nga ng financial support. hindi yung pang emotional support di ba kasi yun naman ang kailangan ng isang tao yung yung support sa sa area na yun um and like in any partnership di ba may in any relationship or mga partnership in any relationship may may back and forth um mm -hmm. talaga di ba so parang ano nag nag receiving and giving of of you know, affection, mga ganon. So it goes both ways na, na hindi lang one-sided. Uh, Kailangan ba magaling mag-board game? <laughs> um, well, Tuturuan mo na lang siya. I, 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 well, sa isang babae, I, I want them to, ano, to, na may, na maayos naman kausap. <laughs> Okay. So, kailangan maayos ka usap. Sige, bye, boss. 
<laughs> Ayan, ano daw ginagawa mo during your pastime? Um, yung past? So past daw ha? <laughs> yung past? past? <laughs> ano, yung pastime ko, mga hobbies. Na, 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 ayun, nagbo-board games, nanonood hmm. ng TV. Uh, Netflix. Oo, nag-Netflix. Um, yun. Yung mga simple lang. <laughs> Eh, si Be. Ano daw yun? Be, hindi cocktail dress yan. Cortina. Kasi ang dami nakasabit sa likod. Tinakpaw mo ng cortina. Huwag kang ano. Eto, uh, si Nebran, tama po, or big while talaga. Kasi mahirap po kapag walang purpose sa mga ginagawa natin. Thank you. Yes. Nakatawala-wala kang ginagawa mo, bossy. Anong oras ka daw natutulog sa kagumigising? Dami mo kasi pinagkakaabalan. Hindi siya natutulog. Kaya hindi siya gumigising. Uh, usually... <laughs> Mga ano, mga one, ganun. Usually natutulog ako lately, mga one. And nagigising ako mga seven, siguro. Ganun. Maaga ako nagigising. Oo nga, kanina. Sabi ko, gising ka na. Sabi niya, hindi. 30 ka na ako. <laughs> Ayan. Si Rhea, sabi niya, message po para sa mga iniidolo kayo and dun sa mga na... na- Ay, oh, may message na kagad. Mamaya na siguro to, pang last na to, Rhea. Oh, yeah. Last na ni, ano, ni Bossing yung mga message-message na yan. Si Sir JD, five years from now, ano po ang gusto mong ma-achieve sa buhay? Kasi life oh. begins at 40. <laughs> Oo nga, boss. Si ano ang gusto mong ma-achieve sa buhay? Well, um, you know, I, I want to make a bigger impact in people's lives in terms of, um, yun, sinabi ko, yung, yung showing empathy, kindness, and love to each other. That's something that I think I'll prioritize for the next five years. Um, gusto ko rin na, well, I want to have, ano, maka-family before 40, Ay, oo nga. Para makatin naman ako ng kasal. <laughs> Flower girl yung ano, inaanak mo. Oo nga, bossing, dalian mo na nga. Nakakaloka. Ano <laughs> ba yan? Mga madali. Pag nakakalakad na pala siya, sige. Pag mga, ano, next three years na lang, sige. Or yun, five years, sige. Abot pa ba? <laughs> Antay ka lang ha, antayin mo lang siya. Si, sabi ni Baby Lina, ito ang ganda ng tanong, how are you as a BF? Sweet ba? Oh, wow. Sweet ba? <laughs> ano ba? Ah, <laughs> uh, yung mga tanong. Nagpa-blush na si Bossing. <laughs> Sagutin ko uh, na. Ano ba? Alam. Ay, alam mo naman. Hindi ko yung... alam. Wala akong alam. <laughs> Sagutin mo yan. Bala ka dyan. <laughs> sweet naman. I think sweet ako. Feeling ko lang, di ba? Oo, oh, sweet Kaya, ano, sweet. Kasi ang, ang reason dun, sige, sige, sige. Ano naman tayo? Parang <laughs> relationship with another tayo. Um, Ba't ka nagpa-blush? <laughs> bigay todo. Well, ako yung tao na bigay lahat. And this is true in business din actually. Um na when when I do something, all parang all in talaga. Bibigay ko lahat. Um well, you know, all bibigay in. Mo lahat. Pati pera mo, bibigay mo, penge. <laughs> <laughs> hindi hindi financial. <laughs> sige, sige. Sige, magpaliwanag ka pa. Oh, so yun uh, either either ano either all all or nothing ako. Um, walang in between. Oo. Oo. Sa pagmahal daw si boss. Sige na nga. Mahala ka diyan. <laughs> Ayan, si Romelin daw how do how do you manage your time po? Um, I try to be intentional with my time. And how that works is well, I try to schedule as much as possible. I try to schedule um, or at the bare minimum, I have things that I want to achieve in a certain day. Na, like at the beginning of the day, I say, okay, ito yung gusto kong mangyari today. And then I make sure to achieve them. Or um, even better, if you can schedule, if I can schedule, na on this time, I'll be doing this. On this time, I'll be working on this. Um, for example, let's say um, yesterday. Yeah, well, today, medyo, today, nagising ako at like 6.30 got out of bed mga almost 8 na kasi nag nag ano nag na cellphone lang ganun <laughs> um did my workouts and then um uh, talked to my tita um and I didn't and meeting ganun I didn't start working until after lunch actually um until later so medyo flexible ganun um pero like yesterday nag co-work nag co-work pumunta ako sa co-working space I uh, was there from 10 to mga 4 ganun <laughs> Pa, di ba lockdown kayo? Oo, oh, oh, pero pwede, pwede, pwede exception daw. Pwede mm. pa rin. So, hindi ka naliligo kasi wala doon sa schedule. 
Hindi siya nalilipat. Hindi ko naman, pero 15 ah. minutes lang yan. Ano ba? Ah, okay. Sige, sige. Para klaro lang. Eh. Sabi ni ano, parang kami, define maayos kausap. Yung kanina sabi mo kasi mas maayos kausap. Yung ano, yung mga... Yung, mga, yung matino. Yung matino yung kausap. Matino. Matino yung tamang word pala, no? Yung mga... Uh, if you talk about things na may may sasabihin siya na or may may opinion siya ganun mm. no ilang parang ayaw niya nang wala lang yung mga walang kwenta ka usap <laughs> hindi naman kailangan na parang an elaborate kasi ako parang when i talk about something i can get very elaborate hindi naman kailangan na ganun pero at least alam ko na na nagets niya and then may may thoughts <laughs> okay sige so, um, may ano side comment si Alex, sabi niya, pareho mo daw magtagalog si Joel Binamira, aka marketman. Kilala mo to? From Cebu din daw, owner ng Subuchon. So ironically, Subuchon daw started out like a hobby and fashion side project din. Gaya no? Okay. Thank you for that information, Alex. Ito, wedding bells na soon. Sino ba? Wala po. <laughs> Aba, ewan! Sino ba, Nebra? May nahanap ko na ba para sa kanya? Para wedding bells na si... <laughs> and si... Ah, uh, dito lang. Si Mahar, yan, may tanong. Hindi alam ni Mahar to. May mga kapatid ka, bossing. Nakita, nakita mo, Mahar, yung picture ni bossing pag girl. Kamukha niya yung kapatid niyang babae. Siya <laughs> yung... Kamukha niya yung kapatid babae. Ano yung... Oh, ilan, ilan ang kapatid mo? Kung may kapatid ka man. Older brother na sa Manila. Um, he might watch this because he watches some of the shows. Um, yung younger sister ko nasa Canada with my mom. Older brother ko um, is going to be turning 39 then this year. Yung younger sister ko, um, 26. So, 26. So, tatlo kayo? Oh, tatlo kami. Ikaw ang gitna. Oo. Oh. Ang galing ko, ba? Kasi may younger sister as may kuya. Oh, may younger sister. Ano mo talaga? Oo. The best. O, ayan. Curious lang daw. Nagluluto ka ba? Anong specialty mo? Sunog na steak joke. <laughs> Nagluluto naman. Um, kahit madali lang naman. May Google naman eh. Uh, eh, masarap ba? Masarap yan. Yung, yung, yung recipe naman masarap. So masarap din. Sino nagsabi na masarap? Oh. <laughs> okay. Eh naman daw, baby. Lee. Nagluluto naman siya at masarap. Sige, maniwala tayo sa kanya. Mamaya na yung tips niya, Brutus. Ayan na yung pinakahulo ni Bossing, yung tips for success. Si Jessica, in time of pandemic, how you hand, how do you handle your boredom? No. <laughs> Sir JV, thank you so much for all the help. I'm in coming three years VA because of you. Oh, okay. Oh. Yes. Um, how do I handle the boredom? Um, I look for something to do, I guess. Um, I, and what I try to avoid, because like usual natin, usual, I guess, tendency natin is when we get bored, we go on Facebook, we go on Instagram, and then we spend like two hours there, diba? That, that's what happens. And then, lalo na ngayon, like on, on Facebook, and daming mga, mga nakaka stress na news, diba? So, um, I, when, when I find myself doing that, I realize, I catch myself and say, I'm well, not all the time, but sometimes I catch myself and say, hey, I should be doing something else. Like um, reading a book. If, if you feel productive, you can read a self-help book, or if not, you can read a fiction book or even watch a TV show. Um, and I think na it's better for you to watch TV than to go on social media um, because in social media, na kaka depress and it gives us the habit na it creates the habit na lagi tayong kailangan ng stimulation um, sa brain, yung dopamine. May, may science behind that. Pero nakaka-addict siya kasi maraming yung dopamine. It's like drugs, actually, yung, yung social media. And so when we're spending a lot of time on it, it gives us those parang mental stimulations na ba- m- mababaw. Um, so yun, read a book, watch TV. You can play video games, ganun, pero you can try to catch your... What, what I, my advice there and what I, what I try to do is I try to catch myself when I'm going on social media for too long. Ayan. Ola, ano, bilisan natin itong sagot mo. Ano daw favorite TV show mo? Um, dami. Um, Isa lang. Hindi <laughs> naman sinabi niya shows, TV show lang. All... Pili ka. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> sa madami. Show. Isa lang, isa lang. Shows na lang, shows na lang. Sige. Um, yung Rome sa HBO, that was one of my long-time favorites. Uh, the Expanse, 
um, Space Space uh, Battlestar Galactica. Ito ba yan? Parang hindi ko lahat naririnig. Yung mga favorite show mo, nakakaloka. O, anong dream business mo? Ano? Dream business? Ano daw, sabi ni Mahar, anong dream business mo? Anong dream business ko? Um, Parlor. Joke. <laughs> Peace lang. <laughs> sa ngayon, well, sa ngayon, di ba, yung sinabi ko kanina na parang I want to find a way to yung spread yung ano, yung kind good of good vibes, yeah, love, good vibes okay. na yun. Um, iba, it, it keep changing actually. Yung sagot ko dito, pabago-bago lagi. Kaya nga, bakit, ba, bakit ka nangangamot? Nasa stress ka daw ba, sabi ni Ben? Stress pa kita. <laughs> Kasi pag umangamot na si Bossing, nasa stress na siya. So tatapusin na natin dahil napastress na siya. Ayoko naman nasa stress si Bossing. Eh, ano ba uunahin natin? Yung tips mo o yung announcement? May announcement style, di ba, na babahagi? Huh? Ano ba? Makakalimutin tong batang to. Di ba may announcement tayo? Hindi mo ba alam? Oo, oo, oo. Ay, nakakaloka. <laughs> Siguro yung tapan natin kanina no, sa meeting. Um, oh, oh. Mm-hmm. So, um, a lot of you guys know that we have, di ba, yung free access sa VA Bootcamp. Um, this coming Sunday sa birthday ko, di ba? It's 24-hour free access. Hopefully, di magka-crash yung site, pero we have over a thousand people who have already registered. Oh, yeah. So, fingers crossed na okay yung website. I hope not all 1,000 people access at the same Wag time. Piling ko po, oh. lagot, 1,000 to. Patay ka. I'll, I'll, I'll Baka sa birthday ko, ano lang, I'm troubleshooting the website the whole day. Um, pero, yeah. Um, so, for those, ito yung mag-enroll. Ito, ito yung... Oo. Uh-uh. Uh, sige, sige. For the first, after, after that, for the first 50 that enroll to accelerated or complete package, I'll be doing a live training on Canva. Um, with you guys. So Canva is a grab, parang Photoshop na a lot easier to use. So if you enroll, um, if you're one of the first 50 to enroll, starting June 28th, um, yun, you'll, you'll be part of that special um, live training. So live meaning, you know, it's going to be live. You can ask me questions there. Yeah. So hanggang June 30 lang yan, di ba, Bossing? Mag-enroll from June 20 uh, to June 30, meron kayo nung webinar? First 50. Okay. Oh, like it. Yon. So, ano pa? Wala na? Wala na tayong ano? Announcement? Um, well, on sa June 27, hindi ko alam saan tayo mag, ano, mag, mag-live lang kami, maglalaro ng game. Oo, oh, kung bet niyong manood. Be, sumali ka sa ano, board game ni Bossing. Uh, hindi ko alam kung, kung dito sa page or sa, sa personal lang. Tingnan natin. Personal na lang siguro. Oo. Oh. Ikaw. Ayun, o oh, sige. Tapos yung ano mo na, yung kaninang mga tanong ng iba na mga tips mo to succeed or ba? Yung mga sa newbie, mga tips ba? Sige, well, ito yung, yung tip ko. Um, tip ko for everybody is no matter what level you're on, kung newbie ka pa, kung freelancer, uh, if you're even in work, or if you're in business, whatever, um, tip ko is to always look towards the next level, the next stage of whatever it is you're in. Okay, so it could be in your freelancing, it could be in your career, it could be in your business, it could even be in things like you know, your self appreciation mo, it could be in your personal relationships. Diba? But always, always look towards parang raising, raising the level, raising the bar of where you are. Diba? So, whatever it is, because um, you newbie, ka, diba? you want to get hired. Diba? If, if hindi ka na newbie, maybe you want to hit the 100K mark. If nasa 100K ka na, maybe you want to earn more. Or maybe you want to do something else, start a business or, or help other people. Ganon. Um, same thing like sa, sa career, di ba? Maybe you want to get promoted. Same thing sa business. Sa, in taking care of yourself then, you know, maybe it's your personal, your, your physical health. Maybe it's your mental health. In your relationships, di ba? Maybe you should, parang you want to be closer to your friends or your family. But always look towards going to the next level um, because that you can move towards there and then get higher and higher and higher and then yeah, you'll get closer to achieving your goals and have parang having a more fulfilled life yeah. Yee, ayon. thank you bossing at dahil dyan gusto ko lang di mag ano mag thank you tal- paulit-ulit naman to nag thank you na sa- ako sa'yo dati pa pero yun um, isa ako dun sa naging successful dahil sa VA Bootcamp and patunay na talagang effective yung course tapos marami ding naituro yun nga yung next level freelancing na yan ni bossing yung entrepreneurial mindset na yan naituro niya yun sa akin kaya kami ni Honey nagkaroon din kaming agency ganyan kasi yun yung mga natutunan namin talaga sa VA Bootcamp so very thankful ako and um, yun sana ano 
i-bless pa ni Lord ang ano, ang vab kasi marami talaga tong natutulungan, di ba? So, sabi niya, ipakasabi daw. So, sabi daw, <laughs> anong ibig sabihin niya, be? Paki ano, paki Tagalog. <laughs> Ayan, sabi, sabi ni Be, isa din sa pinakamulit, oo na, sige. <laughs> ako daw ang isa sa pinakapakulit na student. Oh. Tinrain ako ni Bossing maging makulit. Para ano, para masaya. <laughs> Ayan, so sa lahat ng mga nanood, nanood, nag-stay talaga sila bossing. Mga FCC, mga less than 50 yung nanood, pero ngayon talaga nag-stay sila. Pinanood ka talaga nila. So yon thank you sa lahat ng mga nanood. At kahit wala si Phoenix, yan, next week naman siya, ano, pagaling ka Phoenix, kung saan ka man naroon. Eh, may tanong to, last na lang to sasagutin ko. Pwede daw bang ma-access yung ano, new site? Mag, mag-ano ka, mag, mag-upgrade ba? Tama ba, Bossy? Oo. From old uh, from old to new, may upgrade. May upgrade fee. Nakalimutan ko makala yung upgrade. 50% off ata. Um, Oo. May upgrade fee. Oh. Oh, kung, ano, kung accelerated ka, 50% nung in-enroll mo na course para ma-upgrade. Ayan. Oh. And then huh? new, may access sa new course. May access sa bookkeeping, may access sa English. Better English. Uh, oh, okay. E-commerce. Oo, oh, sa so e-commerce. May access ka doon sa new site. Ayon, so yon, so so ano na? Thank you so much, guys, for watching. <laughs> Abangan yung ano yung live ni Bossing ng ano ng ng aming ano board game para ma board kayo. <laughs> Ayan sabi ni Beso supportahan daw. Ano to? Oo, sino supportahan pa kita be? Whatever be. Okay. <laughs> Ayan Bossing happy birthday. Pero dapat ina makatawid sa birthday mo tama na nga. Sige. Ano? Alright, thank you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.